Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast review and today we're going to take a look at Carlo Maserati from Cars 2. So before we get right into the review let me discuss something. So Carlo is a one of a Porto Corsa inhabitant who is one of the Porto Corsa inhabitants who was seen at a casino talking to some friends and he is named after the re his the real Carlo Maserati which he is a Maserati so before we get right into the review let me discuss something and, and oh wait I did that already so now let's take a so now let's get right into the review here we here we've got his friendly shiny smile and his friendly facial expression, his headlights and Maserati logo and the shiny chrome silver gray grill and a Maserati logo and his headlights and on and here we've got his shiny silver rims and his four doors and on the back we've got his exhaust pipes and tail lights and the license plate saying fish bowl so, so now let's compare which he shares the same license plate as Acer and other cars like Mel Dorado Cruz B. Soro Fred Fish ba Fred Pacer and Vladimir Trunkov and other cars that share the same license plate. And on the right side, same repeated design. And that is it. So, so Carlo is a 2010 Maserati Quattro Pay V sedan, which Maseratis are made in Italy. And now let's compare them to other cars with that are that are Italian. So we've got. Michael Schumacher, who is a Ferrari. Francesco Bernoulli, who is in a, who is an F1. Uncle Topolino, who is a 1937 Fiat 500 Topolino. Luigi, who is a 1959 Fiat 500. And Guido, who is a Alza Tato forklift, and and let's compare him to other sedans. We've got Christina Wheeland, race official Tom, Natalie Certain, Skip Richter. RPM crew chief Fred Jonathan Wrenchworths and Herbie even though he has although even though he has two doors although he is a, considered a sedan though and that is pretty much it so what do you guys think which which Italian car is your favorite and which sedan is your favorite so leave your thoughts in the comments down below and if you have enjoyed this video please give a thumbs up and subscribe and also don't forget to leave any suggestions of which car of the past should I review next so I hope to see you guys next time goodbye now